So we are looking at the brand new Rodian Schwartz RTB 2004 digital oscilloscope. And I wanted to show you this feature, which really needs a video to do, and it's called annotation. So here we have a simple sine wave. And I'm going to push the annotation button and push it again. And I'm going to select this yellow arrow. And I'm going to draw and say, this is the important part right there. But I also want to put a note there, because I don't know what that means. So I'm going to hit it again, and I'm going to just type the text, and I'm going to say this one. Hit Enter, and this one, this one, comes up right there. And, oh, that wasn't what I wanted, so I'm going to go in and I'm going to erase the whole thing, because I didn't really want that at all. And, and I can hit it again and get rid of everything. There you go. So you, can, you can put your own notes right on your scope screen. Hit the button over here and save the image. Okay, so we're going to look at the FFT function on this new Rodian Schwartz RTB 2004 digital scope. And we've, got a, we've got a simple square wave over here. And let's look at the FFT. So I'm going to push the button. There's also an FFT icon up here, but I'm going to use the button. And then I'm going to hit the auto set button. And let's see what it does. And there you can see the there you can see the odd harmonics from the square wave. And suppose I want to look at that in a little more detail and focus on the frequency domain. I can slide that up and get a bigger image of the um, of the frequency domain, or if I need to look at the time domain in a little bit more detail, I can just do that. And if I want to save the image, just hit the camera button, and it's saved.